No, this bud is not for you. It's for the Morris Brown College Marching Wolverine Band. In fact, $12,000 worth in cash. Anheuser-Busch and the Atlanta Beverage Company are footing the bill for the Wolverine's trip to New York in the Macy's Parade. Ironically, the check comes just days after Operation Push leader Jesse Jackson and Mayor Andrew Young held a news conference asking Atlantans to join a boycott of the St. Louis Brewery because of what they call poor affirmative action policies. But to Bush officials, it's all just a coincidence. We are involved in, with organizations in all types of uh, community programs throughout the entire country on a regular basis, so that's basically our response. And the boycott has nothing to do with it? Well, that's absolutely correct from the standpoint that you bring it up in this conversation because we were involved in several programs before this subject ever, ever came up. So as I said, Anheuser-Busch and Budweiser Beer are, are, are totally committed to each individual community where it does business. And what do the band members think about Jesse Jackson's boycott versus Anheuser-Busch's $12,000 gift? These people have been extremely, extremely supportive to uh, our program. And I would be a hypocrite if I said I would stop drinking Budweiser Beer. Um, I agree with what Jesse Jackson's doing. Um, economics is the main issue here, whether they are uh, positive toward the black community as a whole. Many of these band members have adopted the old adage, don't bite the hand that feeds you. And besides, a lot of them are too young to drink. The only thing on their minds is a trip to the Big Apple and performing before millions and making Georgians proud. And they won't leave many questions about who paid for them to get there. Rob Sweeting, Action News Tonight.